What are vertebrae? All of us are aware of fights between dogs and cats. They cannot survive together, but still they have some common features. Do you know what is that? They both are vertebrae. So exactly what are vertebrae? Vertebrae are the members of subphylum vertebrata under the phylum chordata. They are the organisms which possess a notochord in the embryonic stage, which is replaced by the cartilaginous vertebral column in an adult organism. Vertebrates also possess two, three or four chambered muscular heart, kidneys for excretion and osmoregulation and paired appendages which can be either fins or limbs. There are approximately 40,000 species of vertebrates in the world and they are divided under two divisions. Number 1. Agnatha and Number 2. Nathostomata Let's study the characteristic features of different vertebrates which lies under these divisions. Agnatha is a group of primitive jawless vertebrates and includes a single class cell Cyclostomata. Cyclostomata is ectoparasite and has 6 to 12 pairs of gill slits for respiration with a circular mouth. They have a closed circulatory system and the body is devoid of scales and paired fins. For example, lamprey and hagfish. Nathostomata are jawed vertebrates and roughly comprises 60,000 species and include two superclasses. Number 1. Pisces and Number 2. Tetrapoda Let's start with the first superclass called Pisces. Pisces possess fins and they are further divided into two classes, chondric thighs and osteic thighs. The membranes of chondric thighs possess jaw and cartilaginous endoskeleton while the notochord is present through their lives. They have a rough scaly skin and have a two-chambered heart. Scoliodon or dogfish and trigon or stingray are the examples of class chondric thighs. On the other hand, members of class Osteic thighs possess a bony endoskeleton and four pairs of covered grills for respiration. They are cold-blooded, freshwater or marine water animals with two-chambered heart. Fishes like Rohu, Katla and Seahorse are the examples of class Osteic thighs. The next superclass is Tetrapoda, a group of four-limbed vertebrates and divided into four classes. The first class of Tetrapoda is Amphibia. The members of class Amphibia can live in aquatic as well as terrestrial habitats and bears two or four limbs. The body is divided into head and trunk and respiration is by gills, lungs or through the skin. They possess a three-chambered heart and well-developed elementary canal, urinary and reproductive tract. Frog, salamander and toad are the examples of class Amphibia. The second class is Reptilia. The members of class Reptilia crawl for body movement which is a characteristic feature of reptiles. They are terrestrial animals with dry and conified skin. Limbs are absent in some but if present it is too bad. They possess a three-chambered heart except crocodiles which possess a four-chambered heart. Reptiles are oikilotham and can shed their skin cast. For example, snakes, lizard, crocodiles, alligators, etc. The third class is avis, which are commonly called birds. The characteristic features of avis is the presence of feathers and many of them can fly except ostrich, which is a flightless bird. They have a bony hollow endoskeleton with air cavities. The forelimbs are modified into wings and hind limbs are modified for walking and for clasping the tree branches. They are warm-blooded animals with four-chambered heart and possess a beak. For example, crow, ostrich, pigeon, vulture. The fourth class is mammalia. The main feature of members of this class is that they possess milk-producing glands called memory glands to nourish their young ones. The members also possess hair, external ear, limbs for walking and running. They have a four-chambered heart and respiration is by lungs. They are found in a variety of habitats such as polar ice caps, deserts, mountains, 
forests and dark caves. For example, cat, dog, horse, lions, etc. Let's answer a few questions asked in the medical entrance exam. Question 1. Agnatha includes Number 1. Hagfishes Number 2. Fishes Number 3. Jellyfishes or Number 4. Flying fishes This question was asked in AIPMT 2010. Solution. Agnatha is the class of jawless fishes comprising hagfish and lamprey. Hence, option 1 is the correct answer. Question 2. Birds and mammals have Number 1. Three-chambered heart Number 2. Four-chambered heart Number 3. Two-chambered heart Or number 4. None of the above This question was asked in KCET 2007. Solution. The birds and mammals both possess a fully developed four-chambered heart. Hence, option 2 is the correct answer. Please like, share and comment on the video and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. For more interesting and educational videos to earn while you learn, download Extra Class app from Google Play Store and get rewarded for studying.